Introducing the Nexus 360, Diderio's first rechargeable omnidirectional tuner. Visible at every turn, from any angle, no matter where you wind up. Nexus 360, built for your next stage. So let's start with this right here. This tried and true old friend cost me a dollar. God. You know, back when I was, I was working at a studio in town called Woodland, this guy that was a friend of one of the engineers, his name was Todd Odie, he lent this to me. And when he came to get it back, he said, you really like that guitar, don't you? I said, yeah. He was an older gentleman, older than me. And uh, so I was like, you know, getting this wisdom from him. He's like, okay. so I'll tell you what, uh, I'll tell you what, you keep that guitar. You keep it. Give me a dollar, and if you ever want to get rid of it, I'll give you the dollar back. <laughs> so, yeah, it's you know, it's taken a few spills. It's been fixed. It's, it looks like it's, yeah. you know, been to the dog pound, you know. Right, that but is not a relic. I, I love it so much that I've got two, mu two more of these, and that's the uh, DiMarzio X2N, oh. which is pretty, you know, just a balls out. Yeah, balls yeah. Balls out, you know, kind of. <laughs> just a heavy rock. Oh, you that's know, great. pick up. So. And is that a badass bridge on you it? You know, I can't remember what that's called. I think it is. You know, I, I, think. Th I think it might be. Yeah. That was put on, God, it's been, well, probably 20 years since wow. I had that put on. So, so, what, so what have you, do you have any idea what year this thing is? Uh, it's a 64, I think, wow. I believe. Yeah, wow. 64 or 65. How you great. Know, so, uh, but yeah, man, they're beautiful. I've got one that's, this is actually a kill switch on. Oh. And I've been wanting to make it a kill switch on all three. Sure. That way, whenever I got it, it's always a kill. Oh, yeah. Um, but it's just a great guitar, man. It's it's a total rocker, <laughs> you know. So what all have you done to it? Uh, the, you know what? The original X2N that was in it went completely microphonic. Yeah. You know, that thing, I think right after, like, She's Country, oh. you know, that was probably the last record I used <laughs> that thing on a sort of... When you turn it on, uh, so I found another one, and the key with those is finding the ones that say 1979 on the back of them. Huh. Um, that year, for some reason, they just rock. And then after it, they're okay, but there's something about these older ones. That, wow. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, man, that that's all I did to it. I played this on so many things. I may have played this on Sable Horse and Ugh. you know stuff like that. But it's always that go-to rocker, man. That is a so, rock and roll machine. Yeah, it's sick.